Hi, in this video, we're going to be learning how to add 3D content to a website using the SwiftXR plugin available on WordPress. To get started, create your new WordPress site. And for existing users, you can go over to your WordPress admin dashboard. Once you're in your dashboard, go over to plugins and search for the SwiftXR viewer and install. Once you're done installing, ensure you activate the plugin. And with that, you can use the SwiftXR viewer to add 3D content to your WordPress website. To do that, head over to the SwiftXR viewer itself. And in here, you can add a new entry. There are two modes currently available. The website mode that allows you to add a generic 3D content to your website and the e-commerce mode that allows you to assign a certain 3D model to a certain products available on your WordPress website. Let's start with the website mode, which is the default mode selected here. And you then want to put in a published SwiftXR link directly in here. To do that, go over to the SwiftXR hub and create a new project. If you are new to SwiftXR, you would be required to create an account. And if you're a returning user, please do sign in. Once you're signed in, create a new project. And with the SwiftXR editor, you can easily add 3D content to your projects by dragging and dropping. Go over to Files, and let's drag in a SwiftXR 3D model here. And hit the Publish button. Copy the published project link, and head back to WordPress, and select Add New Entry. Put in the SwiftXR published project link in here and set the dimension you want for your 3D content. Set the width to 100% if you want it to span across the entire width of your screen and hit the add entry button. And this should generate a short code for you, which you can then use when editing your website. Copy that shortcut and go over to any of the page you have and hit edit. Add the column and then add in a shortcut. And that's how you can add 3D content to your website. Also, we will be adding a new entry here using the e-commerce mode. To do this, do ensure you have the WooCommerce plugin installed. Once that is done, let's build the e-commerce store using one of the templates available. Go over to the products category and create a new product. Once you have a product created, go over to the SwiftXR viewer and create a new entry. On doing this, switch over to the e-commerce mode. Go over to SwiftXR and create a new product for your entry. Once you're done, copy the link once again. Head back to your WordPress website paste in the link you just copied, assign a product to it, and hit the Add Entry button. To preview your product, go over to Home, select the Preview option, and now you should see the 3D model assigned to your product.
you can also change the position where your 3d model shows up on your products page by going back to the swift xr viewer under settings and in here you can change it from the top of the product to after product description after product summary or the product gallery itself hit save and if you go back to your website and refresh you should see it added after the product summary itself